Hey, it's Mitchell. I hope everybody's doing good. I just want to make this video. It's uh, touching on uh, the video I made yesterday after the Logan Paul KSI fight. Uh, I got a few comments, and uh, most of them were good. You know, 98% of them, 99% of them. There was this one guy, and he was saying something about scorecard, you know, because we were talking about points and how two-point deduction is very rare, and it's very extreme considering the situation. <laughs> and considering the situation, it's unheard of, man. It's stupid. But we were debating, and we were saying, you know, if it was a, I was saying if it was a one-point deduction, then it would have turned out and most likely been a draw. But he was saying that KSI would have still won, which is math wrong. <laughs> Completely wrong, because it would have been a draw. But if there wouldn't have been a two-point deduction, then... Uh, um, <laughs> then uh, Logan Paul would have won, most likely won unanimously. But because there was a two-point deduction, KSI won split decision. And how screwed up is that? Anyways, I just want to say, I just want to, you know, respond to that person. You know, have some common sense. You know how to do some basic math, you know. 10 times 10, 11 times 11, 5 times 5, 25, 121, 100. You know, <laughs> or you know, 25, 5 times 5, 25, 11, 11, 121, 10, 10, 1, 1, or 100. Anyways, <clears throat> I also want to say, uh, you know, this is a new thing, YouTube thing. I watch videos all the time. I've been watching videos for years. I've always wanted to start my own channel, but uh, I never have. I'm in school full time. I work a little bit at the school I go to. Um, my passion, dream, and first, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, <laughs> up until the last goal is to, you know, hopefully end up in politics. You know, given I'm doing a lot of different stuff. I've, Two undergraduate degrees that that I'm turning into two double majors. So in essence, I'll have four fields of you know education, and economics, accounting, um, nursing slash medical, and criminal justice technology slash law. So, and the reason I'm saying this is because. Uh, uh, in the near future, I'm really going to set this channel up, and I just want to get viewers, I want to get subscriptions, likes, and see see how it goes, because based on how it goes, because I'm not going to do anything stupid, I'm not, I'm not trying to go out here and do crazy stuff to get views and stuff like that, I, I want to have debates, I want to talk about the world, I want to talk about ideologies, I want to talk about political climate, and Stuff like that, because I feel it's important, and I feel yeah, there are quite a few people on YouTube talking about it. But <laughs> I, I feel like there's not enough people that are listening as well as talking. You know what I mean? And I, uh, and I would say, you know. <laughs> It's good to talk, it's good to debate, but if you're not listening, then you ain't learning. So, I just, basically getting this thing started, you know, uh, I want to get some people on here and see what they like to talk about and stuff like that and start from there and then hopefully build it up. Of course, I'm, you know, interested in making money and stuff like that. But if I can make money and help 
guide or even learn stuff in the same, you know, the same avenue of process, then I'll be good with that. But anyways, comment. Let me know. Uh, give me some questions. You know, uh, what do you think about what's going on with the impeachment inquiry? I mean, do you think it's crazy that the other two impeachments, <laughs> which was um, President Andrew Johnson and um, President Bill Clinton, you know, a lot of people like to say Richard Nixon, but in fact, Richard Nixon wasn't technically impeached. He actually resigned before he was impeached. So the two impeachments in the history of America, United States of America, has been Andrew Johnson. It's 1870 or 1869, some 1872 or something like that. And Bill Clinton, of course. And... Do you think it's right that um, the other impeachments were done in a bipartisan way and both impeachments were done with the full House despite Democrats or despite Republicans? they done it together to come to the truth. And do you think it's fair that the Democrats are doing everything they want and not being fair and not being bipartisan not letting the republicans make their own list of witnesses when they ha they should have subpoena power <laughs> i mean these are stuff i wonder you know, see, these are things i want to debate um just let me know uh, i want to i want to talk to people i want to see i want to see what y'all think because at the end of the day, I do want to be in politics, and and I feel like this is a good this is a good place to meet people, see their point of views, their beliefs, and stuff like that. It's a good place to agree. It's a good place to even even if we disagree, to find you know common agreements. Just message me. <laughs> like, care. Oh, what, what was it? Like, share, comment, subscribe. And let me know what you think. And I'll take it to the bank. <laughs> All right. Y'all have a good night. See you later.